Hi folks, I'm Gary Dunship, Big Ben Saddlery, and this month's tack tip, I'm gonna talk a little bit about uh, care for your braided rawhide products. Um, there are a few things that rawhide works pretty good on, um, more than we generally think about when you go to looking at it. Hackamore people, their uh, bulsals are made out of rawhide. Anybody uses a reatter, maybe has one hanging on the wall. I know a lot of the guys in the ranch horse shows are starting to use a rain and romal. Some of them use them out of the braided rawhide. Some of the head stalls, side pulls, things like that have a little rawhide on them, hobbles. And I'm just going to tell you a little bit about what we use here at the saddle shop uh, as far as taking care of that, preserving it, trying to bring it back to life. All of these products that I have out here will work on it and do a reasonably good job. There's a couple of them I like better than others. Um, the uh, spray-on liquid saddle soap is one. Lexol in any form is good, just as long as it's the regular Lexol conditioner and not uh, something else. They have a Neats Foot formula or something, just the regular conditioner. This Cali Leather Life works good. The paste saddle soap, either yellow or white, works good. The Big Ben conditioner works good. And then the Ray Holes Rawhide Cream. I like the Ray Holes Rawhide Cream the best uh, for most things. And I'll just show you how we go about it here. This is an already open can of it. So you have a Bosal here. This is what it looks like. It's just kind of creamy. You just get some on your hand and go to working it in. Just glom it on there. Just as thick as you can. And it'll fill up all the cracks that are in the rawhide. If you have some rawhide that hasn't had anything put on it for a long time, the cracks might be pretty wide. But if you've taken care of it, the cracks won't be too big. That rawhide kind of contra contracts and expands with the humidity in the air. And uh, so what we're trying to do with all this stuff is preventing the air from getting to it. After you get all the cracks filled up, try and get all the excess off. then just leave it set overnight and after it's set overnight this is what it's going to look like and you can kind of see down inside the cracks there where it's filled it up and that protects the air and the sunlight and everything from getting down in those vacant spaces and uh, causing it to uh, contract even more than it normally would. Okay, that works. I like that the best. These other creams and things will do the same thing. They just don't penetrate as fast um, and they're a little messier, but they work good. The other one that I really like is the liquid saddle soap and I like it pretty much for just the Riatas but I don't know if you've ever picked up a Riata and tried to swing it, but it's kind of like swinging a coil spring. And, but there's guys that use them and, and do a really good job with them, but they'll usually wet them or put something on them before they use them and it completely changes the rope. I like to use this spray on uh, liquid saddle soap and you just hose it down good get it wet all over, do the whole rope like that, and then maybe put it in a plastic bag overnight. And the next morning, whenever you take it out, if it's a good Riata to start with, it ought to feel really, really good. Here's a rain in Romal that's been taken care of. Had some, some uh, rawhide cream put on it over the years and it's just as flexible and
pliable as it can be, feels real good in your hands. And if it hasn't had any care, then the thing will just be like a stick. It'll get so stiff. But uh, things like the, the paste saddle soap work really good. Just do it like I did this, just glom it on. It'll work good, you just don't use it sparingly, just go ahead and put it on. It doesn't matter if it's yellow or the white. Quartz, rawhide on your side pulls, your head stalls, just about anything. If you have any questions about any of this or any of our other tack or tack questions, just give us a call here at the shop. We'll be glad to help you. Thanks for watching.